a look at some of our temperatures right now with a lot of the low 40s. I am not a fan of that. Meteorologist Alexa Trishler joins us now with your first to know forecast. Alexa, I think this is the coldest that I felt this winter. It's really going to be the coldest night of the year so far, so get ready now. I mean, it is going to be frigid. That doesn't even describe it. And that might be those temperatures that you see, but that's not how it feels outside. Thanks to the winds. We'll take a closer look at those winds stoutly out of the northwest, and it's still a little breezy right now. So there's a wind chill in effect. So if you're stepping outside and you're like, I don't care if it says it's 41 degrees, it feels like 33 degrees in Thomasville because of those winds. So these are the real field temperatures outside wind chills in the 30s through South Georgia. 36 is how it feels in Valdosta and Moultrie, 35 in Bainbridge. It feels like 41 in Tallahassee and 40 degrees in Sopchoppy. We've got nothing but clear skies, but the good news is, is that wind speeds should be calming down as we head through tonight. But there's still a wind chill that you can expect through our evening hours. So if you're headed out through tonight, extra layers are a must. And then overnight, we're talking low temperatures dropping to the low 20s. So that is incredibly cold. So if you're going to use like a space heater to heat your house, make sure you keep it away from anything. Make sure you bring the pets inside all of the cold weather safety and the plants too. There's a hard freeze warning in effect from 2 a.m. to 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, and that covers our entire area. So yeah, probably going to be the coldest morning of the year so far. Temperatures around 20 degrees, likely maybe low 20s across South Georgia and the Big Bend. And if there happens to be some light winds tomorrow morning, it'll probably feel like the upper teens.